Childhood. It's meant to be the time of your life, but not for kids in Hong Kong. Here, kids start school three years earlier than in Europe. They go through dozens of school interviews, and before the interviews, they go to classes on how to interview. Extracurricular classes mean many of them don't get to bed until midnight, and the last place their parents want to take them is McDonald's. So, when we were challenged to reconnect with families, we decided to build a one-of-a-kind McDonald's store. A store that celebrated imagination, and at the same time, made parents proud of their kids. We built the first McDonald's in the world that was entirely dreamed up by kids. We put out a simple question. If you could build the McDonald's of your dreams, what would it look like? And kids sent us ideas in the thousands. On our website, on tray mats, by post, and by drawing on special white walls in our restaurants. Schools turned our project into a classroom assignment. Parents voted online for their favorite ideas. They got their friends and families to vote. The idea had gripped Hong Kong. And then we took the top voted ideas and built them for real. turning one of our highest traffic restaurants into the most amazing McDonald's in the world. Designed entirely by kids for kids. Selling only happy meals and packed with happy kids and proud parents. We even auctioned off everything at designer prices and raised almost half a million dollars for Ronald McDonald House Charities. But the best result, even better than our $5.2 million in earned media, was that at last, we were able to show Hong Kong parents that their children are amazing just the way they are.